couldn't be better, thanks. I don't think your tastes are quite particular enough to enter if you, you know, catch my drift. Perhaps you should go play snooker instead. I suppose I should come back entirely covered in rubber. Should clear up soon, I imagine. I hope the baker comes back from holiday soon. Hello. Lovely day for it. I have a bit of a feeling this venue might not be to your taste. Why don't you go away? I suppose I should come back entirely covered in rubber. Lovely weather. You know, I think someone's looking for you. You are. I hope the baker comes back from holiday soon. Hello. Lovely day for it. You flirt. in this suit. At least I'll fit in among pervs. On the other hand, it ought to protect me against electricity and lightning and things. Um, Percy, they said you got a caning at school. Yes. Did it hurt very much? No. Are you sure you're gonna be alright? Yes. Do you understand why? Why you... what? Well, why you got the caning. Yes? Did you really kick a rubbish bin in Slathy Crowden's face? No, I didn't! Right. Did you kick a rubbish bin? Yes. Did it then go into Slathy Crowden's face? I... I didn't see him. I... I didn't see him. He came around the corner. He came around for... He came around the corner. Oh, that's not at all your fault, then. Oh, good. Uh, are you being sarcastic? Yeah, I was being sarcastic. I hate it when you're sarcastic! I know. All right! I'm so looking forward to the Battle of Flowers. Aren't you? Sorry, mustache. Oh, much better. Clothes make the man, don't they?
All right. I've done questions. In Rome, I suppose. <laughs> they probably do do this in Rome, don't they? Should clear up soon, I imagine. Right. I can take his stuff, and then I can walk across the bridge to Lud's home with his credentials, can't I? Lovely weather. Did you hear about Constable Rossetti's wife's cake? That's new. my magic wand. I mean, I know where it is. It's in the locker, of course. But I can't find my key. And John Cleland and his friends are coming. They do so love my magic wand. Do you think you can help me find my key? I have to tidy, you see. Could you bring it to me here? Don't touch anything. It's got to be just so for my guests. Lovely day for it. See you at the pub. Lovely day for it. You know, I think we wear the same size. Did you hear that? There! That's the one that did it! There they are. Stop. Keep calm! Keep calm! Keep calm! Keep calm! Keep calm. Keep calm. Down now. Barely looks lifted. Barely looks lifted. Happiness is a choice. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Wherever you are, 
Barely looks lived in. Barely looks lived in. I could take these all the time and I wouldn't have any worries. Day for it? I don't think your tastes are quite particular enough to enter if you, you know, catch my drift. Did you hear something? I suppose I should come back entirely covered in rubber. Couldn't be better, thanks. I saw a spanker spanker down just now. It was so jolly. Curve in this suit. At least I'll fit in among pervs. On the other hand, it ought to protect me against electricity and lightning and things. Right. I can take his stuff, and then I can walk across the bridge to Lud's home with hey, his credentials. Can't leave I? my stuff alone!
Barely looks lifted. Barely looks lifted. Snug as a bug on a drug. Oh, I look like an utter perviness. On the other hand, it ought to protect me against electricity and lightning and things. Lovely day for it. Father McCartney preaches such a thought. Should clear up soon, I imagine. Right. I can take his stuff, and then I can walk across the bridge to Lud's home with his credentials, can't I? Lovely day for it. Watch out for scurvy. Uncle Jack says. Up roses. Uncle Jack says. I forgot to tell you. <laughs> Couldn't be better, thanks. You're looking nice and trim. Lovely weather. I'm going to take Bantai lessons. You should come too. Lovely day for it. Did you hear? Boggy Jack got another one. Lovely weather. Last night. See you at the pub. Best day in. Is that her magic wand? I could use that as a sort of unbreakable head knocker. I have a feeling that's not what they use it for, though. Should clear up soon, I imagine. Well, anything worth talking about lately? Nothing but blue skies. Well, hello, dearie. Couldn't be better, thanks. Oh, much better. Save a bit for the next minute. Sweet dreams, Arthur.
that feels entirely too good. Lovely day for it. Righto. Would you like this? We are not accustomed to such generosity on the part of the populace. This is for you. We don't get a lot of thanks in this line of duty. There you are. You know, I think we wear the same size. All right. Fancy a cuppa. Lovely day for it. I can't wait to see how they fixed up Lud's home. You can't hide forever. I only want to help you feel better. You won't get away with this. Come out, come out, wherever you are. <laughs> <laughs> are you? They did it! I know they did! <laughs> I got better. <laughs> You'll do it! You can't deny it! They've got blood on their hands! What do you want? You won't get away with this. You <laughs> want to help you feel better. things to do. 
you. Hide your head in the sand. I don't care. Are you feeling all right? Right. Enough of that, then. I've got better things to do. Are you sure you're feeling all right? to be happy watching the day go by where did you go i got better things to do that's the spirit look who i found Take your joy Ooh. wet blanket <sighs> Excuse me, I've been asked to check up on Dr. Faraday. Where's Bobby Hickenbotham? The executive committee don't let just anyone drop by the lab, you know. Why not? Because they might be friends of Dr. F. You know what Dr. F could do with a bucket of motorline and a handful of mechanical bits? No, I don't either, and that's the point, isn't it? He's, uh, <laughs> at the Reform Club, again. What are you implying? Uh, apparently he feels a bit guilty about Dr. F. You don't know about his, uh, Beauchamp? Bobby Hickenbotham is marrying my sister. And I will thank you not to cast any perverted aspersions at his reputation. 
I have been ordered by the General himself to ask for credentials from the Beautification Committee. Have you got any? There you go. Fine. Watch out for anyone chattering away in something that don't sound like English. They're like mad dogs, and they'll give you plague. And keep your mouth shut about pensions, right? Oh, you better take these, in case you do catch plague over there. Not that I would wait. I did think I used to run a hundred bases. Lovely day for it. What? Lud's hole. That's where they've quarantined all the wastrels with plague, isn't it? That's a cheery thought. It was just a cough. Well, he's sprouting, isn't he? He said he hadn't got a scratch. I'd call those scratches, wouldn't you? Are you sure it's safe to get that close? You won't catch it from looking. There could be spores. Try not to get bitten. They go a bit crazy towards the end. Thanks. I'll be careful. Run, if you don't want to end up like him. about to go. Slumming it, are we? It must be nice.
they've really gone out of their way to isolate Dr. Faraday. They must be extremely dangerous. Roger, I'm going to fix it, because that's what I do, apparently. I'm fucked. We're both fucked. The professor is going to kill us. She's going to tell them to send us away. I'm always mucking things up for her. And, well, Roger's worse. He breaks everything. The professor's going to send us both away. Can you get us a new valve? I'd let you use the professor's lab. Oh, it's brilliant. Dr. Faraday's a woman. It never even occurred to me he'd be a woman. And she has... houseboys. Here. I want you to have this. Oh, brilliant! Oh, this is perfect! Thank you! Oh, you've saved us. Look, go on in. The lab's brilliant. <laughs> Roger will give you a hug. <laughs> Maybe the professor can help you too. Roger? You the sandwich. your joy in me. Roger? I asked for my sandwich, but I'm still waiting for the sandwich. your joy in me. I don't hear it. speak Latin. Because it's 1946 and the Romans left Britain in 450 AD. I can't hear you. Why do you want to speak Latin? You always... You always... You always know. You always know. You always know. You always know. You always know what each... You always know what each word means when it comes out. Impedimenta, the baggage. Impedimentorum, of the baggage and impedimentis to the baggage. So it doesn't matter what all you say things? Yes. So long as you're talking about baggage. What? No, Arthur, I'm talking about... Oh, fuck off. Why are you learning Latin anyway? You still have trouble with English. I can see it in my head. You make the words by sticking endings on them. Well, that seems like an awful lot of effort. When you learn German. When... when you learn German. When you... I don't want to learn German. You just have to stick the right ending onto the word. I don't want to learn German. It's very good language. It has very strict rules. Imagine my surprise. 